the southwestern United States is experiencing a drought of epic proportions. Reservoirs are running low, crops are thirsty, and raging wildfires have become the norm. ashore with more power than Katrina. Hurricane Laura delivered a shattering and deadly blow to the Gulf Coast early today. 150 mile per hour wind sending trees toppling onto homes, unmooring a floating casino, knocking out power while leaving a chemical industrial fire in its wake. China. The country is battling the heaviest rainfall in a thousand years. At least 33 people have lost their lives and many are now feared to be missing. Wading through water is the only way to and from home for these residents. Like that will have a severe impact on the daily lives of people in the city of Ratnagiri. With so many homes destroyed, these women are being forced to eat whatever they can find. We had trees burning on either side. Part of the world that usually epitomizes cold is now unseasonably very, very hot. Regions of northern Siberia are routinely 10 degrees higher than usual. The implications of the heat wave for Russia's landscape are already severe. 1.7 million hectares of forest and tundra are now on fire, including some areas that are less than 15 kilometers from the Arctic Ocean. Water show fires continuing to spread. And this week's blip doesn't alter the projection for more extreme Arctic weather events as the region heats up twice as fast as the rest of the world. Chris Brown, CBC News, Vancouver. The skyline of New York City on Tuesday showcased more than just the hazy shades of summer as it was filled with smoke that had drifted in from some 3,000 miles away 
where dozens of wildfires continue to torch the western U.S. and Canada, led by Oregon's massive bootleg fire. Wildfire smoke prompted an advisory from New York health officials as the region's air quality index hit 118. Across the border, 500 miles northwest of New York City, Toronto too was blanketed by a smoky, smoggy layer. More than 80 wildfires in 13 western states have charred nearly 1.3 million acres. The largest, the Bootleg Fire, now covers an area about half the size of Rhode Island.